Hi, I'm Terry from Summer Circle and I'm here with my colleagues Adrian and Chris. Chris is currently building a fire. We're in the Forest of Dean and we've come to just try and test out some of our equipment and I uh, thought we'd just take this opportunity to do some demonstration for you. This is the Alox uh, petrol burner, sorry, ethanol burning um, campfire, camp stove. Uh, it also found out it doubles as a, a wood burning. I got it from Amazon, uh, 35 quid. It's nice and compact, it's fairly lightweight, um, and I'll get into it and show you what it does. So it's got a nice waterproof pouch that it sits inside, and uh, that's what it looks like when it's all compacted, when it's all packed down. Uh, it consists of two pieces. There's a, there's a, there's a base unit uh, and, and, a, and a lid. So. Uh, if I just take out the, the cookware, the cook, the cook pots are quite small, but if you're just using it to one person, because it's a one person kit, then, then I think it's probably adequate. But, I mean, you can get, you can get a, a good meal in there and you could make a cup of tea in there. So the, so the, the cooking part of the, of the kit itself is, is a two piece that, that quite simply just, just locks together. Uh, and, and that's, that, that, that's, a, he says, it's a bit fiddly, but there you go. Oh, I've broken it. There we go. So anyway, it's 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 locked together, <laughs> um, and then the, the the cooking part of it is is this um, ethanol burner. Um, now the other thing that's in there is is a ring that sits in the top here, uh, and that's that supports your cook pot. So you put your cook pot on there. Um, it also comes with a cloth, so you can wash up afterwards, uh, which the wife would be happy with. Okay, so the ethanol burner itself um, is, is, I mean, there's, I've actually got some ethanol in here now, I put it in earlier. You only need a, a small amount. It's, I, I've, I've got a, this is actually a, a little uh, plastic pot that used to contain party cake sprinkles from Sainsbury's. And it's great, it's ideal for storing. There's plenty of ethanol in there to use five or six times. Um, so you put maybe a quarter of an inch in the bottom of here, and then that sits in there. Um, now the, the actual, cooking part itself uh, you, you take the you take the lid off and that's that's your burner so inside there in the middle that's where I put the ethanol and, and there's a series of small holes so what happens is when the ethanol gets hot you, you light it when the ethanol gets hot the vapors escape from the holes and they create um, almost like a jet of, of, of flame it takes a few minutes to get hot and really start getting cooked ready um, but let's 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 see how it goes so that sits in there um, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go old school here. Um, I'm going uh, to try and light this with a with a tinder and flint. I just need to find them in my pockets full of all sorts. Okay, so I'm using my brand new Gerber Bear, Bear Grylls knife here. It comes with a with a, uh, a, a striking steel piece on the back and a, a, a carb, uh, carbon rod. So I'm going to um, I'm going to try and try and light this this ethanol in here with with a spark. So let's see how it goes. There we go, and that's going. Uh, yep, feel the heat from that. You can't see the flame because it's, uh, it's clean burning ethanol. Um, so it's it's uh, let's let's let it wait until uh, until it gets going really well, and uh, and we'll come back to you. Hi. So it's been about four minutes, four or five minutes now, and you can see we've got a nice a nice hot tornado of a flame going in the middle of there. Now that's that's really hot. I, I, that's keeping me nice and nice and warm. So um, a simple exercise. I'm just going to. Uh, make myself a coffee. Uh, let's pour some water in. And there we go. Now one other tip that I'd like to give you, which is something I've discovered which is great, is um, whenever you stay in a hotel, steal these. Because when you're out camping, they're in, invaluable. It's freeze-dried coffee, and you can just take a coffee, and you've always got a supply of coffee, sugar, uh, little milks, things like that. They're brilliant. I always empty this hotel whenever I stay. So I'm going to let this boil now, and uh, once it's finished, I'll come back to you, and uh, we'll see how long it takes. But I can already see the steam coming off the top of this now, so it shouldn't be too long. Hi. Okay, so it's been boiling now, well it's been burning now, cooking now for about seven minutes. Um, there's about a quarter of a pint of water in here. It's really cold today, um, it's, it's, it's in the sub five degrees um, and there's a lot of wind around so, so it's been keeping the water cool. But this has got a nice rolling boil going on it now, so I'm going to make myself a coffee.
lovely. Um, we did find while we're using this the, uh, the 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 front here. If you if you shield it, then it then then it, it gives a, a more um, a more vertical flame. Um, it doesn't blow around so much, and it, and, and it speeds the, the process up. Uh, what I also want to try with this, and do, I'll do another video um, l later, is um, you can actually put kindling and wood in here and create this uh, a wood fire. So you can use it as a wood burning fire and just keep feeding the wood in. Uh, so I'll, I'll give that a go. Um, and there's another product that we've got, which is uh, which is a windshield, which will which will help with uh, with with the the burn process um, and we'll, we'll do another video on that later so um, thanks for watching and uh, if you like this then please share and like it and uh, visit our website at um, stonecircle.org.uk um, or go and find us on facebook thanks bye bye